Templates and the Setup Wizard. In this video, we will create a string quartet score using the Setup Wizard. When you open Finale, the launch window automatically appears on your screen. If it is not showing, click on the File menu, Launch Window, to bring it up. When creating a new score, you can select a template, which is a pre-configured empty score, that best matches your instrumentation, or you can use the Finale Setup Wizard, which walks you through creating a new score by selecting the instrument staves, entering the title information and score settings. Let's look at the template options first. On the Launch window, click on the Templates button. Here you can find several empty instrumental score setups for band and orchestra. Now let's go back to the launch window and click on the Setup Wizard button. In column 1, under Select an Ensemble, there are also a number of template options listed here to select from. Let's continue on with setting up our Symphony 28 score from scratch. In column 1, click on Create New Ensemble. Let's leave our default page and part settings as is. That is, they're set to 8.5 by 11 and Portrait. A document style contains setup for music and text fonts, layouts and specialized markings for specific types of musical scores. The engraved style is Finale's all-purpose document style using the Maestro font. Let's look at some of the instrumental options available to choose from. In the band category, if you have a large number of instrument staves in your score, you may want to choose band score so your score will have tighter staff spacing in order to get all of the staves on a page. The jazz band style uses the Broadway copyist handwritten font and landscape orientation for the conductor's score. The marching band style allows you to print the parts in folio size. In the orchestral category, you can select from the maestro font or use the engraver font for notes and articulations. Depending on the type of score you're creating, choose the appropriate document style to take advantage of the automatic fonts or layout features. For this string quartet score, let's click on the engraved document style. Click the Next button to go to the next window. In this window, select the instrument staves that you want in the score. At the top, where it says Select from All Instruments, I can do a sort for the type of instrumentation I will be using. Some of the instrumental options include orchestral, wind ensemble, marching band, jazz, and many others. For this score example, choose orchestral instruments. In column 1, click on the strings family. In column 2, double-click on Violin to add it to column 3, or you can click the Add button. Double-click on Violin again to add a second one. Double-click on Viola, and double-click on Cello. Next, to score order, choose Orchestral. Just a reminder, if you're ever creating a custom score setup and want to save it as a template to use again, click on the Save as New Ensemble button, give the template a name, and click Save. It will be added to the list of templates in the previous Setup Wizard window. Click the Next button. Here we'll enter the score information. In the first box, type in Symphony No. 28 in G Major K200. Press the Tab key to advance the cursor to the next box. In box 2, type in Roman numeral 4 for the movement number. In box 3, type in the composer information. Finish entering information in the remaining boxes or leave them blank. 
Click Next. In this window, enter your score settings. Cut Time, Key of Concert G, and 12 measures. Just a reminder, you can always add or delete measures later at any time. For the tempo marking, type in Presto for the text. Select half note equals 96. Note that the tempo marking box is checked so it will appear above measure 1 in the score. There is no pickup measure in this score. Just a note, if you did have a pickup, add the sum of the pickup notes, click on the corresponding note value, and the first measure will automatically be set. Click Finish and your score opens. The playback sounds and instrument transpositions are automatic for each staff.